Okay, so my first SAT was the school day SAT in March. And right when I took it, uh, I got a 600 in math and I knew that that didn't work. So I took it um, in June after watching scalar learning videos and tutoring and stuff like that. And I improved 120 points and ended up getting a 720 in the math section altogether, so. Okay, so um, I first started with Khan Academy because it was free prep, and then I was trying to see um, what exactly I missed on the first practice test that I took, because the answers that they give you um, and the reasoning behind uh, the correct answers are pretty vague, honestly, and um, for the incorrect answers, they're like, this is wrong because the other answer is right. So I wanted a solid justification, so I looked up the questions and ended up stumbling across a video where you explained every question um, in the math section of that test and that really helped me completely just understand exactly what I got wrong and identify my problem areas. So, um, I definitely thought that they were a lot more personal and um, like it felt like I was doing something that was going to have a real payoff because I was communicating with someone that also has taken the SAT recently and um, has success. So I definitely found um, credibility there and then also it was kind of fun watching the videos and watching you take the test in real time and I, I kind of looked forward to it. So that was in opposition to Khan Academy because I never really looked forward to that. It was kind of just like <laughs> work. It just feels a lot more natural learning from you than straight out of a textbook or the SAT blue book. I feel like it feels like a choice and not a chore and um, that's really beneficial in studying for anything so yeah. <laughs>